Hi, hello and welcome back to our YouTube channel Excel by Software Testing where you will learn in easy simple way. Hi there and welcome to this video on shift left testing. In this video we will be exploring what is shift left testing, why it is important and how it can benefit to your software development process. So let's get started. First of all, let's understand what is our traditional software testing process. The traditional method of software testing involves the testing of a software application after the development. It typically involves requirement analysis. This involves understanding of requirement of a software and documenting them. Then test planning. This involves developing a test plan that outlines the testing approach, test cases, test data and test environment. Test design. This involves designing of a test cases and test data. Test execution. This involves executing of test cases and recording the result. Defect tracking. This involves tracking and managing the defects and found during the testing. Test closure. This involves evaluating the testing process and ensuring that test objective has been satisfied. What is shift left testing then? Shift left testing is a testing approach that involves testing earlier in the software development lifecycle, typically during the design and development stages. It aims to detect defects early in the development process, which reduce the cost and efforts required to fix them. So shift left testing involves following these steps. Requirement analysis. This involves reviewing the requirements to ensure that they are testable and identifying the potential defects early in this process. Design review. This involves reviewing the design document to ensure that they meet the requirements and identifying potential defects early in the process. Code review. This involves reviewing the code to ensure that this meets the design and the requirements and defects can catch early in this process. Unit testing. This involves testing individual units of code to ensure that they functions correctly and identifying defects early in the process. Integration testing. This involves testing in the integration of different components to ensure that they work together correctly and defects can catch early. This shift left testing emphasizes collaboration and communications between different stakeholders, including developers, testers, business analysts, to ensure that the defects are identified and resolved early in the development stages. There are several benefits of doing this shift left testing. Early detection of defects. By testing earlier in the development process, defects can be identified and resolved before they become more costly and time consuming to fix. This reduces overall cost of development and improves the quality of the software. Faster time to market. By identifying and resolving defects earlier in the development process, software can be released to market more quickly, allowing organizations to gain competitive age. Improved collaboration. Shift left testing promotes collaboration and communication between different stakeholders in the development process, including like developers, testers, business analysts, and this can lead to better understanding of requirements, improve quality of design, and better alignment alignment with business goals. More efficient use of resources. By testing earlier in the development process, resources can be used more effectively and efficiently as defects can be identified and resolved before they impact down, downstream activities. Better customer satisfaction. By detecting and resolving defects earlier in the development process, the quality of the software is improved which leads to higher customer satisfaction and better business outcomes. How to do this shift left testing? Identify the testing requirements early. Start identifying the testing requirements early in the software development lifecycle. This involves reviewing the requirements and identifying potential areas that may require testing. Involves testing early in the development process. Testing should be involved early in the development process, preferably during the design and development stages. This helps to identify defects early in the process when they are easier to fix. Automate testing whenever it's possible. Automate as much as of the testing process so that it saves times and efforts. This includes using automated test scripts to execute repetitive and time-consuming test cases. Integrate testing with the development tools. 
integrate the testing with the development tools such as source code management systems and continuous integration and continuous delivery ci cd pipelines this helps to ensure that testing is a part of development process and it reduces the risk of defects being being introduced into the software collaborations between development foster collaborations between developers and testers to ensure that testing is integrated with the development process this includes involving testers in the code review and ensuring that developers are aware of testing requirements use metrics to measure the effectiveness of the testing use metrics to measure the effectiveness of the testing and identify areas of improvement this includes measuring the defects detection rate test coverage and defect resolution time also both tdd and bdd can help in implementing the shift left testing approach by identifying defects early in the development process we will see tdd test driven development and bdd behavior driven development in our upcoming videos as we said before shift left testing should be done as early as possible in the software development life cycle you can involve this in requirement gathering design review code review like development review continuous integration and continuous delivery process how it helps in automation automated testing is an essential part of shift left testing because it allows test to executed more quickly and efficiently than manual testing automated test can be run repeatedly and consistently which ensures that defect can be identified and resolved before they impact downstream activities this improves the overall efficiency of the testing and reduces the risk of defect being introduced to your software shift left testing also promotes the use of test automation tools which can be used to automate various types of test including unit test integration test and functional test Test automation tools can help to speed up the testing to reduce the errors and improves the accuracy of the test result. So this is it for today. Hope you like this video on shift left testing. So if you like the video, please hit the like button and subscribe to our channel. Share this video to your family and friends. Reach out to us or comment below if you have anything to know about software testing or if you have any queries, let us know. We post videos on every Tuesday and Friday. Till then, happy testing. Bye-bye.